The Bemidji community is ready to put on a show after months of hard work. Enchanted Sleeping Beauty opens this week after auditions began in January and final rehearsals are now taking place. Jackson Bruner was there to take it all in. The actors from Bemidji's Community Theater are adding a bit of a comical edge to Sleeping Beauty. Well, I heard a strange sound behind me. From Prince Alexander. He's a bit arrogant. Strong. Handsome prince. It's a bit self-centered. What am I to do? He's kind of um, immature. To the dangerous witch Evelina. It's a story all about overcoming the odds. There are the seven wise ones of the kingdom, which are the good witches in the normal story, um, who are invited to the sort of christening party for Sleeping Beauty. And what happens is one of them doesn't get invited, and that one happens to be the evil one, Evelina. So she, as retribution, curses the little baby princess Briar Rose to prick her finger on a spindle, on a, the spindle of a spinning wheel and die at the age of 16. An ordeal that left the queen in a tough situation. Her daughter's been cursed, so she's a little bit, a little bit high strung, a little bit wound up too tight, but means really well and just wants the best for her daughter and for the kingdom. In telling this tale, the troupe has tried to be unique. And in our version, we have some cultural influence. So for example, North America, we will be doing some North American, Native American dancing. I enjoy being in these types of shows because they're so magical. And they, they're relatable, like people can go back to the storybooks that they've read and say, this is what's different, but I really liked that they did this. The show will mark a big anniversary for this theater group. We're not as old as some of the other theater companies in the state, but we're very, very proud of our 35 years. Making this show a celebration of sorts. Oh, I think it's a glorious suggestion. One they hope to share with the public. We are just hoping that people will come in hordes and hordes and hordes and fill up our theater and really enjoy themselves because that's what it's all about. It's pure family entertainment. It will make you laugh, it will, might even make you have other emotions, but it's a great show, so come and see it. It's been a long road, but final Tech Week preparations are underway, and these folks are ready to put on a show. Come out and see Enchanted Sleeping Beauty when it opens on Friday, April 8th at the historic Chief Theater. In Bemidji, Jackson Bruner, Lakeland News. And that show runs through the following weekend with shows on six different days. A final performance will take place on April 16th at 7.30 p.m. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.